it's funny because I really think this place is special even though I really I had a hard time growing up here this wasn't an easy place for a kid like me to live uh, pretty neglectful parents Hi, Ma. <laughs> I'm super happy to be here today. We're at uh, Prime Deli in St. Louis Park, Minnesota. Uh, throughout the little history of Tripping Kosher, uh, it's been quite apparent to me that when we go places, oftentimes it is Judd <laughs> who is recognized and me who they don't know who I am. Uh, uh, so I thought that maybe we could like even the odds and we'll come to a neighborhood that I had grew up in. I know, you know, 60, 70% of the people here. This couple walks in and they're like, John, John, how you doing? And they're so happy to see him. You know who the, that couple was? My parents. <laughs> Nobody loves me. <laughs> we are at the best kosher certified Basic restaurants in the entire state. Prime Deli. This is a Monte Cristo. So what's the basis of a uh, Monte Cristo? Uh, you've got the French toast. Yeah. And that is the pretty, it can be savory, it can be sweet, and in this case it's really kind of putting together towards a uh, Thanksgiving in a, in a, in a Monte Cristo. So. so it's a well-known fact, Mahala does make the best French toast. What I kind of like about this French toast, mm -hmm. it's super griddled. So it's crispy. It's got that cinnamony French toasty on the outside, some burnt sugar, like seasoned well turkey or roasted turkey. Mm -hmm. And then you have the cranberry sauce. Ties it all together. It's a funky cool. sandwich in yeah. a funky town at a funky place. They have a sandwich called Mad Russian. A Russian sandwich is usually, you know, a sauerkraut, Russian dressing, some turkey, whatever. They have a horseradish aioli that they throw in there, which I'm always a fan of. Crispy pastrami, it's a mad Russian. Uh, you want to take a bite with me? This is a five ingredient sandwich that tastes like five ingredients. It's delightful. No, it's it's not, nothing crazy, nothing whatever. It's just a solid banger of a sandwich. You know what? Good fries. Got them got yeah. well done. Yeah, yeah. Did you say well done? I, I like well that. Done. Well right. done fries. Well done fries. There you go. Some Mexican burger, jalapeno, guacamole, some lettuce. Yeah. Their bun is squishy, which is important. It's a lot of bun. It's a lot of burger. We love it when they have enough cilantro to let you know that like the guy in the kitchen is doing his thing. Great lime, great cilantro. There's a little kick from the jalapeno. Yeah, it's little, actually quite a, a little, just little, poquito, little, little. poquito on the jalapeno. Yeah, but that burger is excellent. It's yeah. that small yeah. town. Their burger is always going to be good. You've all heard me talk ad nauseum. We got purified the waters of Lake Minnetonka. And then, and then we went to the Prime Deli. We always love to applaud the out of town, only kind of place, one stop shop pop that you gotta go to. But we think that this place is special because it keeps up with the challenge. And it's a great example of the uniqueness and specialty of a small firm community and kosher restauranting within it. Oh, 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 oh,